Okay, this will be a real short, sweet video that will give you a few tips on how to memorize the derivatives of the six trig functions. So, to me, this is what you have to, have to memorize. At a minimum, you have to memorize that the derivative of the sine is the cosine. You need to uh, also memorize that the derivative of the tangent is secant squared x. And then finally, you got to memorize this. The derivative of the secant x is secant x tangent x. Well, the idea is we have cofunctions. So just a, a little bit of review here. The cofunction of a sine is the cosine. So what's going to happen is, when you since the sine and cosine are cofunctions, what happens is if you do the derivative of a sine, you get a cosine. But if you do, do the derivative of a cosine, you get the cofunction, which is the sine. So that would be negative sine like that. Now I'll show you how you can remember the negative here in just a minute if you had not caught on to that. So derivative of sine is cosine. Derivative of cosine is back to sine. But it is negative. Okay, the cofunction of a tangent is a cotangent. So you can remember this this way. The derivative of the tangent is secant squared. So the cofunction of the tangent is cotangent. That means that the derivative of the cotangent will be the negative cofunction of secant squared. So the cofunction of secant squared is cosecant squared. Okay, and again, it's a negative on that, and I'll give you a pointer on that in just a minute here. Okay, and then the last thing is the cofunction of, I think I meant to put secant here. The cofunction of the secant is the cosecant. Okay, so it goes like this then. So if the derivative of secant is secant tangent, then the cofunction is cosecant. So if we do the derivative of the cosecant, it should be the cofunction of the secant and the cofunction of the tangent. Okay, so that's how that goes. So the thing that you want to kind of look on here is when you do the derivative of cofunctions, the answers are cofunctions. So derivative of sine is cosine, derivative of cosine is the cofunction of cosine. Derivative of tangent is secant squared, so the derivative of the cofunction of tangent is the cofunction of secant, which is negative cosecant squared. And then finally, the derivative of a secant is secant tangent, so the derivative of the cofunction of secant, cosecant, is the cofunction of secant, which is negative cosecant, and then the, the uh, cofunction of tangent is cotangent. Okay, so that's how that goes. Now the other thing that you want to remember is if the trig function begins with a C, with the letter C, then you're going to have a negative answer to the derivative. Then your derivative is going to be negative. So notice on this, cosine, cotangent, cosecant, all are negative. Okay, so again, if you can remember, memorize the derivative of sine, memorize the derivative of tangent, memorize the derivative of secant, then you can find this uh, like this. Begins with C, it's a negative, and then just do cofunctions. Cosine, sine, secant squared, cosecant squared, secant tangent, cosecant cotangent. All right, so I hope you followed that, and that will help you as a quick way to remember um, the definitions of the derivatives of the six trig functions. Good luck.